to wherever you are, you're watching me this evening, as quick as possible, share the broadcast with your loved ones. Connect as many people as you know. Let the people all over the world now join this very broadcast so that you can be among the people who will be able to hear the accuracy of prophecy before they begin to happen because uh, we are in the season of what's called virological prophecy to make sure that the prophecy that God is bringing is a type of prophecy that the whole world must know that God is still the same yesterday, today, tomorrow and forever. He is not a man and can never ever turn to man. He remains God even though he might wear the body of man to come as Lord Jesus he is still God in the midst of man. So right now wherever you are watching me, share the broadcast with your loved ones. Let them know that the major prophet of God is life life direct. Life direct to be a blessing. So begin to share this broadcast. I am waiting for 50 people that will share this broadcast wherever you are watching me. Miracle will jam you. Favor will locate you. You will see the hand of the Lord upon your life and you will know that the word of a prophet is not a word to be taken in vain. As you're watching me right now, as you share the broadcast wherever you are, receive your miracle, receive a favor, receive a blessing from the Lord and comment like, comment there and also like the program. Let the people know that there's a program you're watching right now. All over wherever you are, just say, I connect with my family. I connect my family. I connect with my family. I connect with my family because every connection you connect to this very program, miracle is bound to happen by fire by force. Whether anybody likes it or not, that's what's called the grace of God at work. The hand of the Lord is not far. The hand of the Lord is not short. The hand of the Lord is not too heavy that God cannot reach you. So I don't care where you are. All I know is that the hand of the Spirit of God will reach out to wherever you are. Because as you're watching me right now on this very accuracy prophecy, accurate prophecy moment, every prophecy that comes out of my mouth will be a blessing to you. And I see whoever is in the sickness or whoever is complaining of any sickness right as you're hearing me, healing is taking place in your body by fire, by force. God is in his hands and God is touching your life and God is taking away every shame, taking away every problem. God is taking away every attack. God is taking away every failure. God is taking away whatever that causes you pain. God is taking away whatever that hinders you. God is taking away every satanic object against your life. Somebody's watching me right now. There's a moving object in your body. As I'm talking to you now, that movement that is moving from the crown of your head to your soul, sometimes it will move move and come to your waist. You move from the waist to the knee, moving all over the body. I command that moving object to hit with the power of the Holy Ghost. The prophetic word of God should go straight to your body and take away that moving object out of your life in the name of Jesus. Wherever they are, whatever it is, they are using against you. As a prophet of God with the accuracy of prophecy, I prophesy that between now and the 24 hours, you never see that movement again in your body. It is gone and it's gone forever. It is gone and it's gone forever. It can never return to your body because whatever God has set free, the Bible says, whosoever the Son of Man shall set free shall be free indeed. You are free indeed and can never ever at any time be in this sickness anymore in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you Holy Ghost because somebody is already healed. Somebody is already delivered. Somebody already set free. Somebody already blessed by the Lord and the blessing shall be permanent in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Glory to God who has healed you. Glory to God who has set you free. Glory to God who has done great and mighty things in your life. It is well with you. It is well with your spirit. It is well with your body. It is well with everything within you in Jesus name. Today once again you are welcome. As I'm speaking to you right now, the Lord took the major prophet of God and said the hour to prophesy is now. The hour to tell the world what is written in the calendar is now. So wherever you are, share the broadcast so that you will be among the people that will say, I was there live when major prophet of God was prophesying. As I'm speaking, the Lord took me in the realm of the spirit and I see myself in a place where God took me to stand. And I stood there and the Lord said, look upon the face of Africa. Look upon the face of Africa. And I was sent 
and standing set on where God has picked me and put me. And I look upon the face of the Africa and the Lord said, upon the face of the Africa, I am giving you a word for all the African nation. And they say, Lord, what's this word? The Lord said, tell them and ask them, who is next in Africa that is about to be visited by God? Oh my God. I begin to wonder, does it mean that God is about to visit Africa? What is God coming to Africa to do? What's going to happen? What is going to happen now? And the Lord said, tell Africa that God is sent. To visit Africa. Mara Brokoto Shinkatala Barakata. What is God coming to Africa to do? What is He coming to Africa to, 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 to perfect? Is God coming to Africa to do what? And the Bible said, God said, What next that the time has come for God to visit Africa? Hmm. Africa rejoice. Africa celebrate. Africa be happy. Africa, trust your God. Africa, put your confidence in Jehovah, the creator of heaven and earth. For the hour for your daybreak is now. As I begin to look at the spiritual world, the Lord saying that the wars and all the problems in Africa is going to be handled by God and God alone. And those who deceive you, the African nations, those who always confuse you, those who always bring you people to hit your heads together, those who always use you against yourselves, use you against your brother, use you against your people, use you to destroy your people, those who normally use you against your people will be under God's checkmation and God is about to completely expose all of them. But the hidden things will be exposed so that those who wrongfully use you will no more have asset to use you Africa. Africa rejoice. Africa celebrate. Africa dance. Those who wrongfully use you will have no choice anymore to use you but to pack their loose and go, but to forsake about you and allow the will of God for your great destiny to brighten up and come up in the name of Jesus. Because I am seeing what's called people now going ahead to discover what's called mystery on how to now become senior engineer, inventors, developers, and people who now begin to become programmers and people who are the set of engineers that is going to emerge from Africa. Some of them will be coming down from other western nations where they are taking a kind of a kind of a kind of a brain drain a kind of taking them away to use them outside and also use them far away. Some of them will be coming back to come and assume the seat of blessings in Africa. And I see African nation rising again and standing fame and overcoming their challenges and conquering those things that normally conquer them. All Africa people people rejoice for your hour has come rejoice for this is your day rejoice the lord has remembered you rejoice it is well with you rejoice god has said to you rejoice god has placed you in the top right there on the top that you may fulfill your purpose and your destinies in the name of jesus christ mm -hmm.